All right, so as you can see, we're in a different spot. We're down here in Falborough Town, and the reason for that is I have uh, I've done a little bit of work. I grinded our team, uh, you know, our main, our kind of our main team that we've been using lately, up to like 90, 89, 90. And I also put Midge Kami on the team in replace or in place of Harvey because I saw that we have Mirage Mountain here today. So we can finally get the two Pokemon that we can catch on Mirage Mountain. And oh my god, I already see Lugia on the bottom screen. Alright, Factorance is out in front. Good, good, good. Wait, does uh, Mitch Kami have an item? Mitch Kami doesn't have an item. Um, Mitch Kami, you can have... Um, I don't really have anything that you can really make use of, do I? Uh, take the expert belt? Sure, there you go, Mitch Kami. That was Harvey's, now it's yours. Alright, well, let's see what we can find on here. That's... Wait, is that Deoxys? Oh, <gasps> it's Arceus! Alright, we're getting an Arceus, hell yeah. Dude, it's the God Pokemon. Man, I kind of wish there was like a vanilla way to catch Arceus, because that would make a good finale for the season. Oh, what the fuck? Are you kidding me? Really? Really? Arceus, why would you do that? That means I only have two chances to get you in a Pokeball. What? Oh. Arceus. What? Arceus, please get caught. What are you doing? Why did he use Perish Song? No! Why would it use Perish Song? That means if I don't catch it here, Factorance is dead and Arceus is dead. Uh, I mean, I have this. I have a Master Ball. Is it worth using our only Master Ball on God? It's. I think that's fitting to use the Master Ball on God. Arceus will be the only Pokemon that we haven't caught in a Pokeball. Because it used fucking Perish Song. <sighs> oh shit, I still got the XP share on. Well, Nephis grew to level 91. Good job, Nephis. Arceus, the Alpha Pokemon. It is told in mythology that this Pokemon was born before the universe even existed. This Pokemon. This. Right here. Is God in the Pokemon universe. Like, there's no... There's no debating it. This thing created the universe and all life. This fucking goat stuck in a fence. <sighs> ah, well, Arceus, we are going to nickname you... Um, Maximam. That sounds like a good name for you. Maximam. Well, I'm kind of annoyed that we couldn't catch that in a Pokeball. 
but there was nothing I could do. It was either let Factorance die or miss out on catching a Pokemon. Let me just, there we go. How much money do I have? No, not that. Actually, you know what, forget it. Let's go try another patch of grass. I think there's one down here. I'm looking for the item on here as well. <gasps> Hold on a second. No, no, there we go. Hell yeah. Oh, oh, I did some research as well. We can get something cool in this episode, actually. Uh, is there a bridge down here? No. Okay, this is the only patch of grass. What else is in here? What the fuck are you? Um. Oh, it's a Zekrom! I don't want a Zekrom. Sorry. We can get Zekrom after we catch, um... Uh, Yuxi, Azelf, and Mesprit. We're still waiting on getting Azelf, of course. Come on, disappear! Disappear! There we go. There is no reaction. What? <laughs> Come on. Come on, something spawn. I want to, uh, I want to get something cool. We already caught gods. Is that another god? That's another god. Yep, yeah, that's, that's god again, okay. No thanks, gods. No thanks. You know what, I kind of would have preferred if Drayana didn't add all the legendaries to these places, because then I could actually get more Pokemon to use on my team. Like, I'm not using legend- is there an item here? No. I'm not using legendaries on my team. I mean, I might, um... I might decide to, like, meme it up and uh, use legendaries against the league. I'm still unsure. Because I just want to power through the league, and I think that using, like, a team of six legendary Pokemon to just blitz through the league... We've got itself on my team. No! Arceus, stop spawning. Thank you. Yeah, I know I was spot. I don't want an Arceus. That's a Zekrom again. I don't want a Zekrom because I can catch one in, like, a, a unique Mirage spot. I mean, Lugia's on the bottom screen. That's Arceus again! No, Arceus, please! Let's get rid of it. There we go. Come on. Give me some... Oh my god, what are you? You're a Giratina? Or Palkia? It's a Palkia. No, we can get we can get Palkia some other way. Come on. Come on. That's uh Dialga? No, that's Zekrom again. I'm not having much luck at getting a good Pokemon around here. I mean, once you call God itself, it's kind of hard to top that. I might just try and risk it in the grass. But, like, you can get a Zek... That's Arceus again. You know what? We're going to risk it in the grass. Let's see what we get. Be something good, please. Oh, fuck! It's ho ho <laughs> That's good. That's good. It's not good for Factorance who uh, could die if it uses a fire move, but we gotta get a Thunder Wave off. This is good because I've done the research and we need both. Um, Ho Ho. I think it's Ho Ho and Lugia. No, it's Ho Ho or Lugia on our team to get, um... Ah, uh, let's risk it with... I don't want Mijikami to die, because Mijikami is one of the few Pokemon I've been able to teach False Swipe to. That's why you're on my team, Mijikami. But, if you get hit by a fire move... Ah, oh, fuck. It's Bug and Steel, so it's dead. Ah, oh, Mijikami, dude! <sighs> I put so much goddamn effort into getting Mijikami to evolve and everything. And it just dies in its first battle on the team. <sighs> alright, alright. I guess I deserve that. Um, I don't really want to risk hitting this thing with a move. It might just be a case of throw Pokeballs and hope. Oh, 
Ho ho, please, come on. Ho is eventually going to run out of moves and just start hurting itself. It might only have Calm Mind left, and that's why it just keeps spamming it. No, I didn't bite. Sorry, Ho. Yeah, I think Ho Ho only has Calm Mind left, so it's going to start kill hurting itself. So now it's going to be a race to catch it before it kills itself, basically. I don't have another Master Ball, so I can't throw a Master Ball at it. Because, I mean, Sacred Fire has like five uses, Fire Blast has like five uses. Sky Attack, or whatever move I had, the Sky move probably has about ten uses, so... I think it might only have Calm Mind here. I have to keep hoping that the Paralyze stops it from moving, because otherwise I'm in trouble. Oh, come on, Ho-Ho! Why would you do that? Just get caught, come on! Ho-Ho really doesn't like me. Really, really doesn't like me. Hey, Ho Ho likes me! Thanks, Ho Ho! You took a while to get caught, but, um. Eventually we got you. Ho Ho! The Rainbow Pokemon! Ho Ho's feathers glow in seven colours depending on the angle at which it's, they're struck by light. These feathers are said to bring happiness to the bearers. This Pokemon is said to live at the foot of a rainbow. Well, I mean, it obviously doesn't, because we just caught it in, like, a bit of grass on a mountain. Uh, you're going to be named Starflare. Star... Starflare like that? Yes. There we go, so there's... There's those. Look at Lugia and Ho-Ho chilling together at the bottom screen. How sweet of them. Yeah, that took a long, long time. Ho-Ho is just kind of screwed with me there. Well, we got Mirage Mountain finally done. We still have Nameless Cavern, so I can get a Zelf now. But, I mean, a Zelf might be like, um... Like what I did with Yuxi, where I just kind of skip ahead to, um... When I catch it. Because I don't think that it's... I mean, I've lost goddamn Mitchkami, who we're going to bury now. Uh, look at God. <laughs> look at God. Look at the moveset on this guy. Recover, Hyper Beam, Perish Song, and Judgment. It would recover its own health. It would destroy us with Hyper Beam, because that's a stab move. So that's 225 damage. Perish Song to fuck my Pokemon over. And then Judgment. You were just designed to kill me. You really were. Oh, you got the Sacred Ash, excuse you? Also, yeah, 5-5. Five, five. Okay, yeah, it has 20. So yeah, it basically was stuck on just Calm Mind left. But I want to take the Sacred Ash. Thank you. And we're going to uh, put you guys in there. I'm really annoyed that I had to use the Master Ball. Because I wanted to get everything in Pokeballs. But it was either that or let Factorance die. And I didn't really want to let Factorance die. So it had to be done, unfortunately. Let's get this. It's been a while since I've buried a Pokemon. Midkami, we used the gym catch just to evolve you, buddy. You lived most of your life in the daycare. We finally took you out. I leveled you up a bunch. We went out of our way to get you to evolve. So that way, you know, we would have a really cool Pokemon. I felt like you deserved it. I even, I even wasted a goddamn heart scale teaching you Iron Head. And then I taught you Aerialize. You were geared up to be a cool Pokemon. I mean, look at that special defense. Look at that attack. 251. You would have been really goddamn good. And you just died in one hit. And it is my fault. I did send you out against a Pokemon with a four times 
super effective move against you, but... <sighs> I'm sorry, Midge Kami. It, it wasn't your fault. It really wasn't. <sighs> I don't really have any Pokemon that can learn... Um... I mean, you can probably learn False Swipe, but you're not... you're weak. All right, you know what, Harvey, you're coming on the team. Welcome back, Harvey. Uh, right, so before I go and get Azelf, Azelf is going to be the, the end of the episode. I want to work on getting this bike that I read about. So, just to make sure, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go back to the battle resort down here. And apparently you have to talk to somebody on a bike here, which I'm pretty sure we've already done, but I want to double, triple, quadruple check. Uh, let's go find him. Also, the music reset again. I don't know why the music resets, but... Where are you? No. Wait, can I go in that house? Did I go in this house? Hello. Hello. I'm a custodian here at the battle resort. All I do is take out the trash in the morning. Oh, that's right, yeah. I don't know how long it takes for trash to respawn, even if it does. But, um, whatever. We're gonna find the guy on a bike who is... I felt like he was on the beach, which doesn't really make sense because he's got a bike. But, uh, nope. Okay, so I was wrong. So he must be up here somewhere. Um. Hello, bike dudes. Bike dudes, where are you? Huh. Maybe he disappears after you speak to him because I could have sworn he was... Alright, well, let's go test this. Let's go test this. So what we need to do is we need to go to... Morvile really quick. And I think that we need to get a Mac bike. Oh, wait, no, I'm wrong. I'm looking at my list here. All right, we're going to do this real quick. We're going to do this really, really quick. So, the rider appears once you once you speak to two people. Basically, you have to go somewhere with an Acro bike, speak to somebody, then go and get the Mac bike, speak to somebody. So, here on Route 119, we need to go essentially somewhere that only the Acro bike can go. Which, uh, from what I remember, is that little path over the over the river. It should be nice and easy to find, because I roughly remember where it is. We go down, down, and then, yeah, down here, that's fine. Um, it should be here, right? Like here? Ah, there it is, I see it. I see you. Hello there, Carnivine. Didn't we have a Carnivine at some point? I don't remember what your name was, but I remember you being uh, pretty alright, actually, Carnivine. But let's see, we got across here. This is something I never did in Alpha Sapphire, because I didn't know it uh, It was a thing. Okay, no, not there. Are you this way? No. Eh, eh, there we go. Huh. Maybe the biker is just somewhere on the route, and not necessarily... Hello there, Tropius. I used to call you Tropicus when I was younger. I don't know why it clearly says Tropius, but... Let's see, is it down... 
there are bikers like in the grass, for example. I don't think it's across here. Um, biker. Nope. Run away, Tropius. No thanks. Uh, ooh, hello. How did I miss that? I mean, I can't use it because I don't have a Venusaur, but still. Yeah, hi Carnivine. I know you're here, buddy. I know. Just, um... No thanks. You and Tropius go and hang out. Leave me alone, please. Um, biker, biker, there you are, hello. That's no good, when I ride a bike in tall grass, nobody can see my coolness. So is it you? Alright, well, I'm going to assume it's him. I'm going to assume it's him. So the next thing we need to do is go get the, the Mac bike. And then go to Route 111, and there'll be another dude we have to talk to somewhere around there. Alright, so... this way? Yep. And then Rydals is right here. Hey dude, I want to change bikes. Yep, that's fine. Thank you. Yeah, 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 that's fine. I, I don't know if I have to come back to you or not, but I'm good for now. God, it's so fast. Did we? I think we had a Mac bike at some point, didn't we? When I was doing the, um, the cycling road stuff. Alright, so we need to find Route 111, which I believe is here, isn't it? Yes. I know my way around Hoenn. I know my way around Hoenn. I spent enough time here as a kid, and I've also put over 100 hours into this save, so... Alright, so I believe that... This is still 111, yeah. So we need to go up here. Um... What are you doing? Hello? How did you manage to climb your way up here? Do you use a strange power like me, I wonder? You rode a Mac bike up here. That, was, that wasn't some strange power. Do you think I could ride one too? Um, fuck. Alright, dude. You're here to get your Pokemon killed. I understand. Also, looking at my list, that Hex Maniac was the person we had to speak to. Alright, Factorins, you make quick work of this guy, please. Let's just hit it with a... Thunderbolt. Uh, I should have done Flash Cannon. It would have been super effective, at least. Not super effective, uh, Stab. But, that's still good. Sorry, dude. You shouldn't have challenged me. Also, hey, because Factorins is Steel Tape, he's not getting affected by the Sandstorm. Hell yeah. Alright, and Flash Cannon. Perfect. There you go. Sorry dude, your Pokemon are dead. I think there's an item here somewhere. Is it? No? Alright, never mind. Alright, so we're going to take off again. Also, I saw a Gibble in the forest. How did I miss getting a Gibble on my playthrough? I guess that's where Brendan got his. Uh, so we need to go back to the Bat Resort. All the way back down here. And now there should be a bicycle dude somewhere around here, essentially, that we have to find. If I'm if I'm reading my notes correctly, because I uh I didn't do a very good job at writing down what I needed to do. Uh, oh, oh, there we go. Bicycle dude, no, no, no. Okay, so you must be up here. 
Please tell me you're up here. Um, is it you? Are you just keeping me cool? No. Is it you? Have you seen the sign? Nope. Um. Bike dude, where are you? Bike dudes? <gasps> oh, he's not here. I thought that, um. It must be the acrobike stuff that I need to do. Yeah, I'm looking at my, my notes here. You actually need to speak to a bird maniac. I was looking for a bicycle, a guy on a bike. So I got it wrong. So we're going to go land back here. I'm not, I'm not even going to have time to get a Zelf in this episode. <laughs> a Zelf is going to have to be next time. Unfortunately. I, I try and keep the episode under like 40 minutes and this is already getting close to 40 minutes. Alright. God, it's so slow now compared to the Mac bike. I mean, I prefer the Acro bike, but the Mac bike is still really good. Honestly. When you play through the game, you should probably pick the Mac bike, honestly, because then you can get very... The Acro bike gets, like, secret areas, whereas the, um... The, the Mac bike is just... Yeah, the Mac bike is for shortcuts, and the Acro bike is usually for secrets. Alright, so we gotta go find a bird dude somewhere. And I know that I passed a few on the way. So it shouldn't be too hard to find one. It just depends. If he, if he brings up the, the bikes, then I know I got the right person. Hello. Ever since I was a little kid, I was in my bird Pokemon. No, not you. Okay. Um, you're a Pokemon Ranger. See, well, I mean, shortcut there, or is the Acro bike is just secret areas, mainly. Uh, hello. Do you use the text mode? Nope. Yeah, yeah, I already know, I already know, I already know, I'm running out of time. Come on. Um, bike dude, no, you're a child. I mean, bird dude, not bike dude. Um... Let's try and go across the water here. I don't know if there's a trainer over here, but we'll we'll check it out. Hello? Oh, hello. Hello. I see Oh no, that's the that's the one I've already been across and there was nothing there. Damn it. <laughs> I can't wait to like give up, finish the episode, look at look up a guide and be like, actually it's on route 118. You are off by one number. Um, bird dudes, where are you? Um, yeah, I'm not seeing a bird guy around here anywhere that I can speak to. Uh, alright, I'm gonna go and look up real quick. I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. It turns out that you need to go up the waterfall, which is where I missed out before. So, uh, oh wait, can I go up th there or is that blocked off? Um, it said far north, so I'm guessing it's the second waterfall, not this one. But yes, we're not gonna have time to get to Zelf in this episode, I'm afraid. So that will be next time we're gonna get a Zelf. But I feel like getting uh, God and uh, and a Ho Ho in this episode isn't a. Uh, too bad when it comes to progress. Also, what am I doing? I can just, I can just do this. This is how lazy I am. I'm calling this <laughs> this mythical Pokemon from my PC box to come here, pick me up, go through the pain of Mega Evolution. Like it hurts Pokemon to Mega Evolve. I think I've told you about it before. But it like puts Pokemon through like extreme pain, and like only the love of their trainer keeps them like from you know, getting seriously hurt. Uh, let's see, so we need to go and teach Pokemon Waterfall. I'm gonna have to go and visit the Move Deleter again. Uh, Liam. Hey Liam, buddy. Buddy Liam. You are gonna get rid of Ice Beam because I can just go ahead and teach you that back once I remove Waterfall. There we go. 
I wish you could just surf into it and just go up. You know, kind of like how strength you can just kind of walk into boulders after you've used it once. But yeah, here's here's the acrobite course. I haven't actually been up here, wow. It's got TMs and everything up here, which is cool. There we go. Alright, so... Uh, 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 come on. Up. Up one. Oh. That, that actually tricked me. I was like, why can I not move? Hi, Kecleon. You better be a shiny or I'm leaving. Yeah, I'm leaving. Sorry, Kecleon. You know, I've actually thought about doing an episode where I train shiny hunt. I think I might actually do it. But it won't be like the decks now. Ooh, I don't want to battle. Sorry, kids. I want to just uh, get this bike. But yeah, I've uh, I thought about doing an episode where I just chain fish to cat to get legendary Pokemon. Not legendary Pokemon. Uh. Nice jump, you can do all kinds of stuff with that bike too. I always remember one to fly around. Maybe I should get one for myself. Alright, so now. Now the dude should be there. So, ah! You know what? Screw it. I don't need that. It was probably only like a potion or something. Alright, so now we go back to the bat resort. All the way down here. And there should be a guy with a bike who talks to us and we get the Mac bike and the Acro bike. So we gotta find the guy with the bike. Um, I'm looking at the list here. Let's see. Oh no, we've already talked to him. I remember when we first came here, we spoke to somebody about a bike. Because I'm looking at the I'm looking at the guide here, and it specifically mentions someone that we already spoke to. So if I go back to Morvile, I should hopefully get this bike. If not, then I'm going to give up. I'm going to go cry. Because it means I've wasted all this time. No, 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 118, Morvile City. There we go. Alright, so, I really hope this works, because I never did this in the original game. Hello. Oh, it's you, I've been waiting for you. Many people have come to my shop, they saw you riding a Rydal bike. Here and there, and they want to buy a bike too. Thanks to you, my business is thriving. As a token of my appreciation, I'll give you another bike. Thanks. Oh, so you just get both. You don't get a, a mixed bike. That's what I thought you did. I thought you'd get, like both bikes combined, where you just like press a button and um, you know, switch. Well, I mean, I've already got kind of my D-pad like with items that I want, so... <sighs> well, I mean, that's not bad, I guess. I guess I can just quickly switch whenever I need to, but... That's, that's gonna do it for this episode. I'm sorry that, uh... oh wait, did I speak to you? Hello. Hi, I'm the trader. I want me to trade you some for a decoration. Um, oh, I read that as fire. Never mind. Uh, let's just heal real quick. Yeah, so next time I guess we're going to get a Zelf, and um, I'll think of something to, to make progress towards, because, you know, I kind of want to make pro- well, I want to make progress on the story. Maybe we'll do the SS title. I'll look at the levels of the SS title for next time, and, uh, We'll see how that goes.